Scorchy's Corner. Durwood Daring of Park Slip, Virginia, can say more about himself with five minutes of music from his violin than his tongue could utter in hours. Durwood Daring began taking violin lessons at age 10, back in the days of his youth when he had two good hands. I had uh, followed a process where I developed to where I was really happy with how I could play. And wham. <laughs> the wham Durwood referred to was the accident that cost him his right hand. He was 31 years old. His musical river was frozen for five long years. Then something happened to cause it to thaw. His daughter was learning to play the piano. Music once again reverberated throughout the home, and a burning desire surfaced within him. To pick up the violin again and try to do something with it, uh, regardless of the hand missing, and see what I could do with the uh, bow uh, as the main problem. The uh, thing turned out to be a lot better than I'd thought. Durwood Daring was back from the brink of musical oblivion. Since that day many years ago, he and his daughter Linda Thornton have been a team of inspiration and joy to many at church functions and nursing homes. She on the piano that inspired him to overcome his handicap, he on the two violins that he crafted himself. By now it's apparent what kind of music Durwood Daring loves best. I've done some uh, classic, which is really my first love from way back. But my newer love, uh, the gospel, the uh, religious music, is, is really God's work, and that's what I think he wanted me to come back to and do. Durwood Daring, a man who can replenish a human spirit with one hand and the melodious sounds it elicits from the strings of a violin. Scorchy Toes, Wandering Our Marvelous Land for WBOC News.